Hello my friends and welcome back to another beautifully play here on my procedurally generated super mega biome Minecraft server. I'm over here at my mushroom, Mount Mushmore as I've been wanting to call it lately. And uh, I just uh, am getting it wrapped up today and today is the day it needs to go out. Why didn't I get it done early you might ask? Well, I apologize but uh, I came down with the flu. It was pretty bad <laughs> and uh, I was uh, out of it <laughs> and uh, there was no getting up. So, uh, yeah, I'm a little behind, I apologize, but you know what, it's going to be okay. I think you're going to like it anyway. So, uh, today we're going to work on getting this mushroom cap uh, finished off also. One, two, three, four, five, I think I'm going to want here, right? Oh, and the thing about mushrooms is you can't actually shift-click them to get them into your inventory. I think that's kind of weird, but, you know, it is what it is. And if that one comes back two, and then this is going to be a three, I think, across, right? And then this one, that'll go there, and then this will come back to... And this will be a two across, I think. And then let me go see how these are going to look if I do them like that on all the three sides, right? And then also we're going to work on... Let me see. I can just stick it here, I suppose. One. I'm also going to go uh, finish kind of cleaning up the uh, the snow generator, the snowball generator that I've uh, created. Uh, well, it's, it's, uh, I'm not even sure if there is a... a a mechanic for it. Why am I keep filling those? This is the only one I needed to fill in. But uh, yeah, I'm going to have uh, the snow uh, generator guy down here. There he is. I'm going to put some stairs in here. Like, uh, put the mushroom blocks in and put some stairs in. I'll show you what that looks like. And hopefully we should get pretty close to wrapped up tonight. Uh, and I say hopefully because I've only got maybe nine hours before I've got to get this finished and edited and uploaded. So let me see here. If I went five and three and two and I went five and three and two all right, let's do three, five and three and three. Nope, let's do five and four and three. Five and four and three. And, man, another three? Yeah, five and four and three. And then let's go over here and turn that to five and four and three. All right, five and four and three, five and four, three, and now a two think would work good here and yeah 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 yeah, yeah, yeah. for sure and a two would work good here right and then a one would and right here just fine oh and this is that wonky corner anyways yeah so I think this is how I'm gonna kind of go around it and I'm gonna keep doing this so let me go ahead and uh, wrap up a little bit more of this and uh, I'll come right back and we'll show you where we're at welcome back my friends I've uh, completed a couple of steps that I wanted to get done and I'm checking out my little area over there where I was thinking about building a lighthouse I'm thinking more and more that I'm not going to do that unless somebody really wants to see that also up here I am still continuing the mushroom all the way around over here in this corner it's really getting kind of janky and as we uh, get tighter in on the circles it should be a little bit easier to correct but we'll deal with that at the end as we uh, take a big panoramic around it and we'll see how lopsided it looks now let's not forget in, in nature sometimes things happen there might have been like a, a giant uh, tree might have fallen and sliced through part of the mushroom hood at some point it might have healed in an unusual fashion so maybe we'll leave it the way it is but the rest of it continues to grow however we have come to our last block of red mushroom cap and it's going to take a lot more to climb in towards the middle so I think that's something I'm going to have to do overnight and uh, get some AFK stuff done. But as you know, I don't have time to do that because this one is coming out soon. Oh, there it is. Uh, as in like in two, two three hours. <laughs> no, I've got about uh, eight hours still to go and I'm still planning on getting that done. So I guess what next is to, uh, I'll probably build these things up a little bit. This might just be a micro episode. Uh, you know, uh, who knows? I, I should make it a micro episode because I, I still... I'm still kind of recovering. So hmm, what I'll do is I'll put, be putting chests in here. And if chests go in here, then these behind here. Let's see here. This one. Chest, chest, chest. All right. So this can be mushroom blocks. Those will all be mushroom blocks because these will just be double chests up to the top. And then this will be a mushroom block wall. And then inside here, we're going to go ahead and use a bunch of half slabs to... Uh, keep the spawn rate down <laughs> to absolute zero one hopes there's a bunch of mobs still spawning outside which is frustrating but you know it is what it is that's what I get for building a mushroom out in the middle of nowhere um boom and here on a couple more over here let's see here yep so I'm just gonna continue doing this for a little bit and oh let me see 
Let me show you if I've got... Yeah, let me just go over here and show you what else I've done. I've uh, got a little bit of stair steps coming up to the mushroom, the mushroom, the uh, snowball form, right? So this will probably get a little bit more decorations, and I'm thinking that I'm going to put the ladders all right here rather than on the side so I can keep the torch there, and then I can just run and jump onto that instead of, like, into this corner. Well, who knows? We'll see. All right, I'm going to get a little bit more built, and uh, I'll show you where I'm at. Alright, alright, we're almost there. Okay. Sweet. Alright, we'll leave for now, and there, and there, and it looks like there, and there. And I think, I do believe, unless I'm mistaken, the entire inner circle is half slabbed. Awesome. Okay, so, I mean, there's still some things I need to work on, but I gotta be honest with you, I'm still dizzy. Uh, and... <laughs> I mean, I'm over the flu, but it's been three days since I've really eaten anything, you know? <laughs> so, I have my appetites back, so I think I might try to make myself a sandwich and uh, <laughs> get some food going. But I'm a little dizzy, so I'm going to cut this one way short today, and I apologize for that. I'll probably come back when I'm more focused and make this cosmetic better. This is definitely going to be improved. Again, I need to go overnight to go get some bone meal so that I can finish the roof anyways. Apologies for that. Uh, but it really put me out of commission for quite a few days. All right, so we've got this this knocked out, and uh, let's see here. I also, inside here, went ahead and uh, built in this section. Ooh, I don't like the way that looks. Yeah, that's going to have to change, definitely. I have those half slabs there so I can open the chests, which apparently aren't going to work because why? I have Forge installed. For job to find. Okay, so I'll have to fix that also. We'll address that. Uh, this is so that when you're filled up with all the snowballs that you're going to be filled up with, you can just break the chest and all the snowballs will fall. And then in here, you'll have uh, snow sacks, like the blocks, snow blocks everywhere, except for right here. And then snowballs will populate that spot. And then when you're crafting, you can just hit the one button, the number one, and then whatever's in here will populate up into there, just like that. Right? So that's what I would do to make snowballs. So I guess now that I think about it, I don't even need this because snowballs are 4x4, four four, but it's nice to have here. And there's that. Okay, my friends, again, I'm sorry I don't have very much time today to get a video done for you, and I'm sorry that I am not well uh, the last couple days to actually put together a great one. But you know what? I'm looking at my analytics. You usually only watch about five minutes of these Minecrafts anyway, so if you're still here, thank you very much for watching. And if you'd like to see more like this, then by all means... Please do consider subscribing for more content coming real soon. And uh, thank you again for continuing to support the channel. I appreciate it. Until next time, thank you very much for watching, and I will see you again real soon. Bye-bye.